What time is it? Oh, it's update time. So here I am working on these panels. And uh, that's the second one now to fill it in. It already looks way better. Wait till it's all one color. I might do it in uh, like a rocker guard, like an undercoating. So next is cutting a stereo hole and refitting the ashtray. That should be fun. I haven't figured that part out yet, but I got a plan. Anyway, so uh, that's where we're standing at the moment. I'm going to continue on with this. And uh, the only thing I don't know what to do is by the steering column. Uh, I might make a piece just kind of wraps around out of uh, vinyl or something, which will kind of help conceal stuff, rubber. Who knows? But uh, pretty soon I'm going to be cutting that piece out and moving forward. This stuff's pretty thin though, I think. Yeah, it's pretty flimsy. Anyway, that's where I'm gonna move for now. I've got a hole too, I might need to patch it. Uh, yeah, so that's next on the agenda, I guess. Back in a bit. Oh, this is hilarious. You know, you gotta keep thinking one, two, three, five, 18 steps ahead all the time. <laughs> Or steps behind I don't know so anyway here I am you saw that plug panel mocked up now you gotta keep in mind there's gonna be cleanup and paint but it's getting there it actually looks not bad I'm kind of happy with that one major drawback though my defroster nut is two and a quarter inches in diameter and in the hole where the defroster duct comes up as i was saying in the hole where the stereo is where the defroster duct comes up yeah it don't fit so option a is by the uh, strictly Bluetooth stereo with no CD in it, which I'm fine with, other than the fact I gotta spend money. They're a couple hundred bucks. They're a nice deck. But I have this one. It's here. It's like right here. So in lieu of that, I still have room over here. And I didn't want to put it here, but uh, that's where it's gonna go. And there will be a little storage cubby. Good plan. And oh, come on, make a fool out of me. There, see? I got that in there too. It took some shaping. And because now you can't grab the bottom to open it, I got a little bit of little bit of fine-tuning to do yet, but once it's cleaned up, and this will get smooth with some body filler, I think, because it's yuck. But uh, yeah, it's getting there. So I'm going to use that as a template and I'm going to make a new panel here tomorrow. And for consistency, what I did with making my panels, here's a piece for demonstration purposes and there's the rest of it. What I did is use my hokey brake over there in the vise. Then I basically made a hammer forming device. I just clamp it onto this little steel table here and I do the second bend so it, I have consistency at least to some point which there yeah so it fits on there good so it makes it easy to make a panel it's much quicker than trying to guess and fight with it I can just hammer form the one side and I'm done so that's that part um I'm going to get this other side done tomorrow and then 
I'll build a box to go with that deck where the deck was. And yeah, I should be able to build a nice size little storage compartment there, which will be fine. My mistake, I'm paying for it, but whatever. At least there was progress today. And I was hoping to be on to uh, dash attack for the cluster. So that'll be tomorrow, maybe. Holy, tomorrow's Thursday already. Anyway, that's where I'm at. So, uh, considering it's three o'clock and I haven't had lunch yet, uh, I'm gonna go eat something and uh, call it a day. So on that note, I'd like to thank you both for watching and we'll see you again tomorrow.